Putting hogs on the mob, planting purple seeds. Baltimore Ravens coat, purple trim, big body, old school for low. Purple rim, seven, seven. What kind of Ravens fam? So, Ravens versus Jets. It's tomorrow. Oh, it feels so good. It feels so good to be almost there. We we ain't gonna even concentrate on the news we received yesterday with the contract. We ain't gonna talk about that. Okay, so. Ravens versus Jets. I'm gonna just start this off speaking about the defense. Uh, the defense. Um, uh, one thing I am looking forward to is, for as the defense, uh, offensive line, the defensive line going against their offensive line. We know they they are banged up. A blank Brown or whatever their left tackle is uh out. Like they saying the dude might even miss the whole year. Interesting. But um, it's going to be, and you already know, if you followed my channel, um, hit that like, by the way, hit that subscribe as well. If you're not already subscribed, but um, you will see that I really believe in this defensive line. We have Calais Campbell, which is, I'm, I'm going to talk about that. I'm going to talk about that um, in a minute. Um, but Calais Campbell we have uh, Pierce, my boy Jones is out, Travis Jones is out. Um, you know, oh, way we got, it's just <sighs> Houston, which I believe Houston's gonna play a lot better this year. Um, but we're like, we're really deep on the defensive line, mainly with when we get, I believe Jones back, it's gonna be interesting how they work it because. It's going to be one side is going to be Owe and Calais Campbell is going to be right like next to him. Then Michael Pierce is right there. Yeah. See, just it's they're just that, just those three in those line right there on that right side or left side is going to be, that's pretty nice. That's pretty special. That's pretty special. But with that pass rush, you know, they got to redeem themselves. We got... Uh, what what he call him? Mighty Mike, Mighty Mike, or something like that. Or Jabo called him in the draft when he was on the phone. Mighty Mike. Oh, well, I can't think of it. But since so far, what I've seen in the preseason, I I know it's just a couple of limited plays, but I'm loving it. I'm loving everything that you know. No quarterback. No quarterback bliss, y'all. It's just that I know I don't said it before, but no cornerback blitz. That right there says I trust my defensive line. I trust my pass rushers, and I, I'm excited about it. I think he's only been doing being a DC for two years, one Michigan, then this is his second year. But uh, from what the players are saying and everything, they love it. You know what I'm saying? Even Calais Campbell saying he, you know he's playing on that edge now. Man, that's gonna be nice, you know. Even say, man, even no tight end can block me. And you think about it, the dude is speaking facts. He's like what six eight or something like that, ridiculous strong. So I, I speaking facts. Okay, then we go to our cornerbacks. You know, MP Juice, man. They put him as a. Uh, questionable to play tomorrow but i believe i believe he's playing marlon humphrey said you know the first day he came out there they do look like the dude looked like he didn't lose a step you know um and i and um for our corners uh mp juice man marlon and kyle fuller i believe they're gonna be out there it's gonna be nice is gonna be, those three right there to me is a nice combination. Marlon, we know he gonna redeem himself this year, I believe. So, and this is a good game to redeem himself with the Jets because uh, I think Jets only have what that boy Sims. I think that's the only person I can think of, uh, and he wants out. I can't think of no wide receiver weapons. My apologies, I, I ain't I don't pay him no attention. You know what I'm saying? That's Jets. Um, but it's going to be interesting to see them 
know, P. Juice, man, Marlon, Cal Fuller go against, you know, Flacco. And I believe Flacco had a problem with Cal Fuller one time. I think it was Cal Fuller when he was with the Ravens. I think Cal Fuller picked him off a couple of times in one game. Think if I'm if I'm wrong, you put it in the comments. I don't you know I don't mind being wrong. Um, but yeah. So then, you know the safeties, Cal Hamilton. You know Marcus Williams, the two cover the whole field. Um, and Chuck Clark. Chuck, I don't know what they're going to do with Chuck. It's going to be interesting to see how they do that with Chuck. Because I know they want to, I believe they want to play Cal Hamilton out there. Because he just covers so much field and Chuck can't do that. Chuck can't cross the field like like Cal can and Marcus Williams can. So, I don't know. It's going to be interesting how that turns out. And also, uh, the linebackers. Uh... I I'm I'm excited. Um, I mean, I'll keep this uh, linebackers last for a reason. I know Bonds and everything. I I don't know, really, you know, he's he's up there in the age. Oh, it's gonna be interesting to see who takes his spot because I believe PQ PQ said three years now, three years in college. It took him to spark. This is your third year in the NFL. Let's see the spark. You've been decent, but this is the Ravens. Ray Lewis set the standard. Then it took us a while. But then we got CJ Mosley. Then he went to the Jets to get that cash. And then that's it, you know? But um, yeah, so we're gonna see how they play. We're gonna see how the linebackers play because that's gonna be interesting. I think PQ is gonna have a good game though. I think the first series, maybe one or two series, it might start a little rocky because none of them played in preseason. But then that switch is going to come on and it's going to be, let's go, green light. So that's what I'm uh, I'm looking forward to. Uh, and then, oh, oh, before I end this video, uh, who was it? You know, who was it? It was somebody on the Jets. They tweeted out, Calais. Let me see if I can find it real quick. My apologies for doing this like right here. I suppose I had it ready. Even my, my, my little man in the back making noise. Let's see, Calais Campbell. It was it was somebody tweeted something out. It was somebody that tweeted something out. There it is. I believe Calais Campbell liked it. Let me find it for you all. I think he liked it. That's what I saw. Uh, let me see. And I'm going to put it up on the screen once I find it. Man, he be liking a lot of stuff. Uh, let's see. I don't see it. I don't. It was a player from the Jets. I don't know if it was. Yeah, I don't see it. Let's see. Uh... Oh, okay. Here it is. Here. Let me put it on the screen for you all. Uh, let's see where there it is. All right, we're gonna concentrate. That one right up, up, up. Hold on, hold on. Hit the wrong button, y'all. Ooh, I just changed something. Let's see. There we go. Look at this mess right here. Right here. Let me move my. Let me move my camera. Hold on. There we go. Right here. Max Major on blocking Calais Campbell. He's a 15 year vet, so obviously he got some salt to him. Big, long, strong, fast, freak athlete, but nothing we can't handle. He's he's a renowned guy, but he's just another dude. He got the check mark and everything, and Calais Campbell liking it. Why would you? If I was a Jets fan, I'd be like, oh, God, he's going to get like 13 sacks. The offensive line already banged up. And you're going to get this man that fuel? You know, just that doesn't make sense. Like, possibly a Hall of Famer. But, 
not a first bad ass, but still. It's like, what? You don't get it? Man, so y'all, y'all be ready. We might be hearing a lot of yes, sir. We might be hearing a lot tomorrow with that, with that, that bulletin board. That's like billboard right there. That's like neon lights in the sky, everything. It's gonna be ridiculous. I can't wait. But yeah, just want just wanted to share just share that with y'all a little bit. But yeah. So uh that's what I think about the defense. Next video, I'm gonna give y'all offense. So uh yeah, it's gonna be interesting. It's gonna be interesting. Bulletin board, it's gonna be interesting. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that share. Everybody stay safe. God bless.